All right, to, today we decided to get the family together, the kids, me and my wife, and come up to the state game lands and just check out the beautiful nature up here. As you can see right there, we just happened to walk up on this moth bedded across this uh, fern. Kind of neat. We got uh, behind us, we got a nice, beautiful, crystal clear uh, water stream that comes down here through the mountain. The sound of it is just, it's beautiful. Just to hear the sound of that water flowing down through, it's gorgeous. Peaceful, serenity. There's a lot, there's a lot of little native trout you can actually fish for in here. There's bigger parts of this creek as you go the whole way down through the mountain. It actually gets to be some pretty, pretty decent sized uh, stream. And they actually will stock some stock trout in there too. But this is, this is well known for some really, really pretty native trout. There you can see we just pulled this rock up out of the water here on this little stream. Got a little uh, nymph right there on the rock. I don't know if you can see that or not. Probably can't. There it is. Here you see we just came up on a nice little wooden bridge. This used to not be here a couple years ago. Uh, but that's a, that's a really nice job they come up here and did. It's neat to see how they take care of stuff like this. But that's a really pretty little bridge right there. It crosses this little stream. So... We're going to take some walks and see what else we can come across to show you people. All right. There we have a guy just come up through here. He's taking a nice, beautiful walk with a real pretty horse. Here's another little, another little good part of this uh, stream. It's pretty wide here. We just walked up on this and seen a couple of nice, pretty little natives sitting here in this little uh, pool right here but then it just took off and went up underneath the bridge here so I wish I could have kind of got them on film for you <clears throat> it's just it's beautiful up here gorgeous up here just to hear the sound of that running water man what it does to me I think a lot more people ought to get out and try and enjoy nature like this. It's good, it's good for your heart, it's good for your blood pressure. Yeah. There you see we got uh, some nice looking, I think they're really nice looking. I love seeing the green ferns like that. Whole bunch of nice, nice mountain laurel. Got a couple hatches coming off here too, I'm noticing. Some sulfurs. And as we go over towards the bridge a little bit more. That is my son. Wonderful son. And his girlfriend. Sitting there enjoying, looking at that nice cold mountain water running down through. Enjoying the sun. And then we got my stepson here enjoying the nature with us.
as you can see right here we're trying to trying the best we can we're at the uh, reservoir here coming down off the mountain there is like a 30 inch trout in here he is gorgeous trout it's gonna be hard for us to pick him up on with the camera we got but we're trying This is the west west branch at the Glen and Lycan. Nice trail back through here. Let's see if that old TP is still back here that the old guys built. We should soon be getting up on top of this teepee up here. It's a man-made teepee. Uh, my wife just pointed it out. It's in this row of pines. If you can see, we got like it's all big, thick woods of nothing but pine trees. And yes, we're coming up on the teepee now. I think it's kind of nice to see stuff like this. What would really make it even better if I happen to see some Indians sitting around up here. Oh my god, that is, that, that's just beautiful how they did that. I don't know if you can see the TP right there, we're going to try to get up real close to it. There's a group of older guys that come up here and they got together and they built that. And you can see here, rocks laying by the tree. They put some type of Indian travel work on, on the rocks. I think it's unique. There's the old teepee. We're going to walk up to it. Oh, isn't that gorgeous? Look at that work. This is actually the first I've actually came back in here to this. There you go. I'll, hopefully you guys can see that pretty good. You see the pole they put here. All the different sculptures on it. I'm going to take you inside this TP. I see they got a bench in here too. You can see here they got the sticks laid out as a bench. A little fire, little fire ring right here. This is beautiful. Wow. I'm inside the TP right now. This is nice. Imagine the time it took to build this. Wow. There's me in the TP looking out. Beautiful. Isn't that beautiful? This is also a really good place to trout fish. 
really fast water moving. It's like this all summer long. I caught a few nice trout in here already. Down from from here, we had a nice hatchery where they did the trout rodeos for the last couple of years, and then we had that bad flood kind of destroyed it. So I'd like to see it get fixed up sometime. Just trying to keep my eyes out while I'm walking because this is well known for rattlesnakes. There you can see out there we got the falls. Beautiful scenery. Well, I believe that's about it for the day. Uh, kind of hope you guys enjoy this video, a little something different. Decided to let the fly rod back in the truck. Do something with the family today. But thanks for watching this video. There we have two mating crane flies. They had just landed on a tree as I was shutting this video off for the day. So I figured I'd check them out real close.